Welcome to Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, the arena of the supernatural, where supernatural is natural. Our vision is to bring Christ's abundant life, knowledge, and hope to Inanda, then to the whole world, in the form of preaching, teaching, holistic gospel, healing, deliverance, counseling, training, and discipleship. Here we go. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, Jesus is Lord. That single belief calls us together as a community and sends us into our world with hope and purpose. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, your past will never define your future. There is always redemption, which means there is always a brighter day. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we do not think that we are better than any other church out there. We are just doing our best to become our best. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we want you to believe in God, but also we want you to know that God believes in you. We are not against any people who do not attend church anywhere. Instead, we pursue them with love, the very same love that is pursuing us. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we are committed to serve God and people. We take ownership and account for our decisions, answerable or accountable as for something within one's power. We do what we say we will do. We are learning to serve God with all our hearts and we are learning to worship Him with all our lives. And if you are looking for the perfect church, we are not it. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we will make mistakes, but we will choose to grow from them. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we are part of a global community that is knit together by the resurrection of Jesus. And by the way, at Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we believe that really happened too. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we will engage with people who are in real need because we are the hands and feet of Christ. And finally, we need you to hear this loud and clear. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, it's not our church at all, but it is His, and we live and move and breathe in His church for His glory and fame, and not for ours. So there's the invitation. You are invited to jump in with your whole heart, at your own pace, and experience the life that awaits you in Christ. Friends, this is going to be good. Welcome to Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, from Dr. Swanem Somi and Tabisilem Somi. Least. I why? Because everything has been We like to criticize one another. When another person is called to do deliverance, prosperity. And another one is anointed for prosperity. And another one for prosperity. Another one is speaking about Another one for the people and then we and we forget that the anointing that is resting upon us is not the same. Mount Zion Carnation, please don't blame people. You may not understand them, but it is a problem with God. God has called them to do what they are doing. Call say others, they are preaching through a country and others say through a country. All of them are doing one and the same uh, job. All of them are doing one and the same job. All of them are doing one and the same job. All of them are doing one and the same job. In in I won't criticize her. Because it is not a people There are people who are called for I'm also called for I won't criticize you because they are not called I'm not called So I won't do the way So in the sense I see a wicked what makes we criticize we look down we we speak ill about each other yet you don't know what I'm called for
I can teach you about my calling and what I've done. You can be amazed. Things that I've been through. Things that I've faced. Things that I have power to do. And the level that I'm in now. You can be so amazed. Sometimes I will stay with a person in the and deliver them. Drama. and there will be no drama but the demons will be cast Sometimes out. Sometimes I will walk in the person in the car drive. while driving but I will deliver How many people are able to do as I do? There are they very few. Bring they think that the demons must scream. But I know that I have power to the 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 silence. I've learned to He didn't allow the demons to speak. Sometimes we are to watch who is a matimon Sometimes to because once they speak, all the plan will be disturbed. Do you hear me? If I can explain about deliverance, others maybe, they can be so amazing. Why? Because you don't know. I was it, but I know what I'm called for. Amen. I will deliver a person while we are sitting at the restaurant. And the demons will be casted out and the person will be freely delivered. While we are just talking. Sometimes it will want to leave and the person will stand up. And he will turn by the door. There, there are no ashes at the restaurant. <laughs> And they will be amazed and be like, nothing is happening, we are just talking. When it wants to speak, I'll be, you want me to embarrass yes, you? It knows that I'm not playing games. I will do what I say. That's what I know and have assurance in it. Sometimes I will be standing in the middle and you will see the person who will be standing. standing on the queue, but you will see the person. And you will see a person who is like, Yet you are just standing there behind. A person will criticize you about something that they don't know or understand. I remember the certain uh, servant used to criticize me. One day when he was about to die, he was told to come and ask for forgiveness. It was the first time hearing God telling a person to come and ask forgiveness. I won't uh, explain much. So, my figure, but when he came, he stayed behind them. And he didn't do what he was told to do. And he came out. He died within three days. Not because I'm special. He was supposed to speak. And then I was going to pray for him and he was going to be healed. But there was a pride inside his heart that caught him up as if he was in the house. When they told him that he was supposed to do, he was being told that his help will be easy. And it was over with him. Something that is very easy. Something that I was told that when a person do something, then I need to do like this. Do you hear what I'm saying? 
I always encourage you not to criticize people. You are in the work that I do. There are some things that I want to teach you, but I can't. Have you ever heard Paul says, I had things that I was not committed. Because when he was going to speak those things in earth, they were going to Sometimes it's not easy to demonstrate those things. Sometimes it's easy to demonstrate those things. Because people like to That is why they, they say uh, Christianity is more than 80 percent. They say Christianity is more than 80 percent. Buganje gate gulunch usugula lamaluz. On recently they were launching. It was on the eighth. Yesterday they were launching the day I'm of sorry, ancestors. I'm sorry, we need to ancestors. Lamadlos, obvious. The ancestors. The launch of corner is South Africa. It was being launched. In other words, they are opening the portal that you South Africa. words, they are opening the portal that you ancestral spirits come and do like this tonight. Others they justify that. But uh, uh, Paul Baina, Baona in my ancestors. Oh David Baina, Baona in my ancestors. Isn't it David and Paul so, but, ancestors? They are launching this day. Support it even being supported in by the organization of alcohol. But when you are launching other things, even the Christian groups I don't know support I don't know how much they spent on but they were launching the ancestral day. I think the sorcerers were calling the ancestral come to South Africa. Have you ever heard of any country that is launching uh, what was happening? It was on the 8th of May. Do you hear me? If we are 80%, now we are 80% that is so segregated. That cannot do anything. It is divided. Do you hear me? It is divided. When the finger tries to push, while trying to pull, it gets tired. When you trying to fight, but the hand needs to be united. So for the hand to hold on something it needs to be Christian Africa, but Christians in South Africa is so divided 80%. just imagine 80% I was in Zambia Zambia is a Christian country By South Africa is a Christian country is the local South Africa was said Still, the percentage in a person was 70 got to a year good by Christian can go by secular country the, even if the percentage was more than still I'm a Christian Christian are many the majority but we are so divided and segregated peace be with you the power is in the church but there's nothing that you can do Jesus said you want it is Jesus who will unite his church I won't try to he said I will even the gate of hell the gate of hell that means even if the gate of hell won't prevail but it is the church of Jesus Christ peace be with you 
It's just that we do not know our identity. We are fighting, we are fighting against a brethren. The person will go and join my friends. Now we won't speak to one another because of the brethren. There is no pastor that I don't speak to I speak to all pastors just because of my name. As they go out, many uh, are coming inside. I don't know how many have come in. This thing is that you are called to a certain person. After a while, you will go to another person. Do you hear me? A person is being called to another person. From 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 you you go to another person. So it's not a problem when a brother says, Bless you, my child. Bless you, my child. May God bless you. And those who will receive you, you were so useful in the church. And may God be with you. 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 When I have to write the letter to the blessing. pastor that you are going to, it will be able to do so. Others, they don't even need our blessing. We understand. In the time that you are eating, please don't make enemies. Let other people make you an enemy, but let not be your enemy, because the mountain of God is a standing field. The Lord is not a mountain, but we will be standing field. The Lord is not a mountain, but we will be standing field. The Lord is not a mountain, but we will be standing field. Maybe in China, we will be standing field. Or that person only. Don't look down upon anyone. Don't take, down, take light of other people. I'm advising you, Father, do not create anything. Do not create anything. When a person no longer wants to be a soul, let him go away. Allow that person to be with you. It's very costly and expensive to be with you. I was not one or wrong, 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 one or wrong. Whether you are the one who is wrong or him, it is costly to make a person happy. So when a person has decided to go, allow that person to go. As he leaves, there are others who will be with you. Or who will you. Or the one who will be you. You won't gonna meet that person if the one who left you didn't go. Do you hear me, brethren? When God said, I have plans you, you need to remember. If you don't know that God has plans to watch you, your life will be filled. You will be filled with one The demons will play around with you. The demons will move as they like in your home. Do you hear me? The demons yes. will do as they do. But once you remember that I am the child of God, this is what God will take place in my life. How come? Did you hear Samson? He said, God, he said, God, remember me just only once. Because the power of Samson was Once he has read in his Hearts and the Nazarene will rose. Remember me just that once. And God remembered him. There's nothing so pleasing. Like when God so ready for action. in your action and in your position and you will say, God, remember me, remember me just only once. The prodigal son was in the world. and he was remembered. and he got himself You see, when you remember, you always go back where you belong. 
That's a power of remembrance. When you remember, you go back to your position. When you are on a position, you ask for God to remember you. Although God has not forgotten you, but because of the calling upon your life, because of the anointing upon your life, He will remember you. His presence will come upon you. When His presence come upon you, you will feel the glory. You will feel the anger. Your gift will arise. When you rise, you will destroy all your enemies. When Samson was angry, he heated the, the pillars in the house. Everybody that was in the house was more than those people whom he killed when he was still alive. You see, when you are remembered, you will accomplish more than what the years have gone by. I pray this morning somebody will remember and remember who you are and remember your position and remember your ID. When I say your ID, when I say ID your identification, you, as, uh, you, you are uh, uh, as the image of God. I am like him. When I enter into the fire, the God is the God. He has made I remember when I was fire. I know when I was fire. He is the one who 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 there is power in remembrance. Sometimes when you remember, it is easy to repent. Do you hear me? When you remember, it's very easy to remember. The man Hezekiah, when they told him that he was in he said, Lord, can't you remember what I've done for you? I don't remember what I've done for you. And God told us and said, Tell Hezekiah that you can't see what I've done for you. Tell Hezekiah that even if you are dead, you can't tell me to kill me. Or to be done, please remember that you are dead. Please remember that you are dead. And remind him. Yes, I can remind him. Please remember. I once remembered. When I was speaking in Clement, I remember that there are visions that I once saw. I and in my power was restored. You know what I remember? I, I remember that I saw what I remember. I remember I saw the world. I remember the world. Africa was the stadium. I was in the world. There was no one in the stadium. I remember America. I remember in from airport to airport. Where I was being transported from airport to airport. I couldn't see where I was being transported from airport to airport. But I saw myself in the airport. The convoy. I was being transported from airport to airport. Where I was going to preach. I was being transported from airport to airport. And then the airport was going to airport. From airport to airport. I remember that I said I would not die. I'm not going to die yet. I'm not going to die yet. Yet. The power of this I felt my I head head I said I'm not going to do what I'm going to do I'm the one who remembers I remembered my identity I remembered what is holding me I remember things I remember things Now do you remember so today? Let me tell you. There are dreams that you dreamt. When you saw yourself in your house. In your house. You bring yourself in your house. It was not your dreams but it was his thoughts. It was not your dreams but it was his thoughts.
It was his thought. When he was thinking about it, now he showed you. Please be seated. I remember. There is a vision that I saw 20 years ago. I saw a brethren following me. 20 years ago. 20 years ago. 20 years later. 20 years later. And I saw him following me. Physically. Physically. I was young. 20 years ago. 20 years ago. I only had 16 years old. But today I'm 46 years old. I said if that vision. That I didn't pray for. That I never interceded. I saw it. 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 When I was, you knew. When I was, you knew. When I was, you knew. Uguti twenty years later. That twenty years later. Lomza la nuzo gwenza linde na ibon. This brother and will do. That's the meaning of the meaning ibon. I said, how many things that I want to know of great things. That is why I'm thinking about 50,000 seeds. Because of the vision that I saw. God didn't want to give me the vision. But it's because of what I saw. What I'm going to be. You see this radio station. You're still going to see. You're still going to see. You see us progressing. You haven't seen anything yet. You haven't seen anything yet. I'm here to remind you. I haven't said. What does it mean that you have thought? Let me emphasize this. This is what I want to emphasize. This is what I want to say to you. This is what I want to say to you. This is what I want to say to you. This is what I want to say to you. This is what I want to say to you. This is what I want to say to you. Are you ready to listen to what I'm going to say to you? This is what I want to say to you. As you were dreaming your songs with his parents, it was his thoughts. He was, he was, he wanted to give a vision for it. He was, he was, he wanted to give Those dreams were the thought that God was thinking about you. All those dreams that you were thinking about. You are not going to be able to design such a dream. The one who showed you that dream. He said, I have thought. Now I want to show you. Now I want to show you. I want to show you. I'm speaking to someone. The last stand up and you're about to pray. I want you to go to God and tell you what you can do when you hear this sentence. Because this week, you will see some thoughts being accomplished. There are people who you saw that you are going to encounter. There are people who will open the door. I'm going to explain next week. But today, I wanted to lay a foundation so that when I see God, remember, today I'm laying a foundation.